In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Come, Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of thy faithful, and kindle in them the fire of thy love. Send forth thy Spirit, and they shall be created, and thou shalt renew the face of the earth. Let us pray. O God, who didst teach the hearts of thy faithful people, by sending them the light of thy Holy Spirit, grant us by the same Spirit to have a right judgment in all things, and evermore to rejoice in his holy comfort. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Epistle of St. Jude, verse 7 As Sodom and Gomorrah, and the neighboring cities, which like them committed sins of immorality and practiced unnatural vices, have been made an example, undergoing the punishment of eternal fire. O good Jesus, I know that every perfect gift, and above all others, that of chastity depends on the powerful action of thy divine providence. I know that without thee, a creature can do nothing. This is why I beseech thee to defend, by thy grace, the purity of my soul and of my body. And if I have ever received any impression whatsoever of a sentiment capable of soiling this ineffable virtue, do thou, O Supreme Master of my faculties, blot it out from my soul, that with a clean heart I may advance in thy love and in thy service, offering myself chaste all the days of my life on the most pure altar of thy divinity. It is the cross that I adore. The cross of the Lord is with me. The cross is my refuge. Jesus, lover of chastity, Mary, mother most pure, Joseph, chaste guardian of the Virgin, to you I come at this hour, begging you to plead with God for me. I earnestly wish to be pure in thought, word, and deed, in imitation of your own holy purity. Obtain for me then a deep sense of modesty, which will be reflected in my external conduct. Protect my eyes, the windows of my soul, from anything that might dim the luster of a heart that must mirror only Christ-like purity. And when the bread of angels becomes the bread of men in my heart at Holy Communion, seal it forever against the suggestions of sinful pleasures. Heart of Jesus, fountain of all purity, have mercy on us. Confirm me, O God, by the grace of thy Holy Spirit. Grant me power to be strengthened in the inner man, and to cast out of my heart all unclean thoughts, not to be drawn away with all various desires, but to view all things as passing away, and myself also as passing with them. For nothing is lasting under the sun, where all is vanity and affliction of spirit. Oh. How wise is he who judges in this way! Grant me, O Lord, celestial wisdom, that I may learn above all things, to seek thee, and to find thee above all things to relish thee, and to love thee, and to understand all other things as they are, according to the order of thy wisdom. Grant that I may prudently avoid all impure temptation, and patiently endure those I cannot avoid, resisting to the end, by the power of thy grace. Amen. Novena Prayers O glorious Apostle St. Jude Fadeus, true relative of Jesus and Mary, I salute thee through the most sacred heart of Jesus. Through this heart, I praise and thank God for all the graces he has bestowed upon thee humbly prostrate before thee, I implore thee through this heart to look down upon me with compassion. Let not my trust be confounded. To thee God has granted the privilege of aiding mankind 
in the most desperate cases. O oh, come to my aid, but I may praise the mercies of God. All my life I will be grateful to thee, and will be thy faithful client, until I can thank thee in heaven. Amen. Blessed Apostle, with confidence we invoke thee. Blessed Apostle, with confidence we invoke thee. Saint Jude, help of the hopeless, aid us in our distress. Saint Jude, help of the hopeless, aid us in our distress. Pray for us that before death we may expiate all our sins by sincere repentance and the worthy reception of the holy sacraments. Pray for us that we may appease the divine justice and obtain a favorable judgment. Pray for us that we may be admitted into the company of the blessed to rejoice in the presence of our God forever. Most Holy Apostle, St. Jude Fadeus, faithful servant and friend of Jesus, the name of the traitor who delivered thy beloved master into the hands of his enemies has caused thee to be forgotten by many. But the Church honors and invokes thee universally as the patron of hopeless cases and of things despaired of. Pray for me, who am so miserable. Make use, I implore thee, of that particular privilege accorded to thee, to bring visible and speedy help, where help is almost despaired of. Come to my assistance in this great need, but I may receive the consolations and succor of heaven in all my necessities, tribulations, and sufferings, particularly. Here, please make your request. that I may bless God with thee and all the elect forever. I promise thee, O blessed Jude, to be ever mindful of his great favor, and I will never cease to honor thee as my special and powerful patron, and to do all in my power to encourage devotion to thee. Amen. Saint Jude Fadeus, pray for us and for all who invoke thy aid. Let us pray. O Saint Jude Fadeus, thou relative of Jesus Christ, thou glorious apostle and martyr, renowned for thy virtues and miracles, faithful and prompt intercessor of all who honor thee and trust in thee, thou art a powerful patron and helper in grievous afflictions. I come to thee and entreat thee from the depths of my heart. Come to my aid with thy powerful intercession. For thou hast received from God the privilege to assist with thy manifest help those who almost despair of all hope. Look down upon me. My life is a life of crosses. My days are days of tribulations, and my heart is an ocean of bitterness. All my paths are strewn with thorns, and scarcely one moment passes but is witnesses of my tears and sighs, an easiness discouragement, mistrust, and almost despair prey upon my soul. Thou cannot forsake me in this sad blight. I will not depart from thee until thou hast heard me. O oh, hasten to my aid. I will be grateful to thee all my life. I will honor thee as my special patron. I will thank God for the graces bestowed upon thee and will encourage devotion to thee. 
according to my power. Amen. Saint Jude Fadeus, pray for us and for all who invoke thy aid. O oh my God, I firmly believe that thou art really and corporally present in the blessed sacrament of the altar. I adore thee here present from the very depths of my heart, and I worship thy sacred presence with all possible humility. O oh my soul, what joy to have Jesus Christ always with us, and to be able to speak to him heart to heart with all confidence. Grant, O Lord, that I, having adored thy divine majesty here on earth in this wonderful sacrament, may be able to adore you eternally in heaven. Amen. For your special intentions. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, as now and will be forever. Amen. Blessing for the sick. Grant Almighty and Eternal God everlasting health to those who believe. Hear us for thy sick for whom we implore the aid of thy tender mercy, that being restored to bodily health, they may give thanks to thee in thy church. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. They shall lay their hands upon the sick, and they shall recover. May Jesus, the Son of Mary, the Lord and Redeemer of the world, through the merits and intercession of his holy apostle, Jude, Thaddeus, and all his saints, Show them favor and mercy. Amen. Litany of St. Jude Fadeus Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, hear us. Christ, graciously hear us. God, the Father of heaven, have mercy on us. God the Son, Redeemer of the world, have mercy on us. God, the Holy Ghost, have mercy on us. Holy Trinity, one God, have mercy on us. Holy Mary, pray for us. Saint Jude, relative of Jesus and Mary, pray for us. Saint Jude, while on earth deemed worthy to see Jesus and Mary and to enjoy their company, pray for us. Saint Jude, raised to the dignity of an apostle, pray for us. Saint Jude, who hadst the honor of beholding thy divine master, humble himself to wash thy feet, pray for us. Saint Jude, who at the Last Supper bids received Holy Communion from the hands of Jesus, pray for us. Saint Jude, who after the profound grief which the death of thy beloved Master caused thee, hadst the consolation of beholding him risen from the dead and of assisting at his glorious ascension. Pray for us. Saint Jude, who was filled with the Holy Ghost on the day of Pentecost, pray for us. Saint Jude, who didst preach the gospel in Persia, pray for us. Saint Jude, who didst convert many people to the faith, pray for us. Saint Jude, who didst perform wonderful miracles in the power of Holy Spirit, pray for us. Saint Jude, who didst restore an idolatrous king to health, both of soul and body, pray for us. Saint Jude, who didst impose silence on demons and confound their oracles, pray for us. Saint Jude, who didst foretell a weak prince an honorable peace with his powerful enemy, 
pray for us. St. Jude, who did stake from deadly serpents the power of enduring man, pray for us. St. Jude, who disregarding the threats of the impious, didst courageously preach the doctrine of Christ, pray for us. St. Jude, who didst gloriously suffer martyrdom for the love of thy divine Master, pray for us. Blessed Apostle, with confidence we invoke thee. Blessed Apostle, with confidence we invoke thee. St. Jude, help of the hopeless, aid us in our distress. St. Jude, help of the hopeless, aid us in our distress. St. Jude, help of the hopeless, aid us in our distress. That by thy intercession both priests and people of the Church may obtain an ardent zeal for the faith of Jesus Christ, we beseech thee, hear us, that thou wouldst defend our sovereign pontiff, and obtain peace and unity for the Holy Church, we beseech thee, hear us. But all heavens and unbelievers may be converted to the true faith, we beseech thee, hear us. But faith, hope, and charity may increase in our hearts, we beseech thee, hear us. That we may be delivered from all evil thoughts and from all snares of the devil, we beseech thee, hear us that thou wouldst vouchsafe to aid and protect all those who honor thee, we beseech thee, hear us, that thou wouldst preserve us from all sin and from all occasion of sin, we beseech thee, hear us, that thou wouldst defend us at the hour of death against the fury of the devil and his evil spirits, we beseech thee, hear us. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world, spare us, O Lord. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world, graciously hear us, O Lord. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Pray for us, blessed Jude, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Occasional Prayers to St. Jude Thaddeus Prayer of Thanksgiving O most sweet Lord Jesus Christ, in union with thy holy mother Mary and all the angels and saints, I praise, glorify, and bless thee for all the graces and privileges thou hast bestowed upon thy chosen apostle and intimate friend, Saint Jude Fadeus. I pray thee for the sake of his merits. Grant me thy grace, and through his intercession, come to my aid in all my needs, but especially at the hour of my death. Deign to strengthen me against the rage of my enemies. Amen. Prayer to St. Jude Fadeus O glorious St. Jude Fadeus, By those sublime privileges which so ennobled thee in thy lifetime relationship, according to the flesh with our Lord Jesus Christ and the Apostolate, by that glory which, as the reward of thy labors in martyrdom, Thou dost now enjoy in heaven. Obtain for us from the giver of every good all the graces we need to enable us to profit greatly by that divinely inspired doctrine which Thou hast handed down to us in Thy epistle, that is, to build the edifice of perfection upon the foundation of faith, praying through the grace of the Holy Spirit, to keep ourselves always in the love of God, looking for the mercy of Jesus Christ unto life everlasting, and to help by every available means those who go astray. Thus shall we exalt the glory, the majesty, the dominion, the authority of Him, who is able to preserve us without sin, and keep us without blemish, and in gladness unto the coming of our Lord Jesus Christ, God our Savior. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.